plus seven here in today's video i'll be showing you guys how to do an instagram reel trend which uses 3d zoom so the applications which you'll need to do this are capcut and vn video editor so we'll be first using capcut and as you can see i have a project here so what you'd want to do is to add your images and once you have them in the vertical format that is the best way to do it so I currently have four images here so what you'd want to do is to tap on an image scroll all the way over click on style and you would need to click on 3d zoom pro so you'll create 3d zoom pro for all the images and then we'll export this and hop into vn video editor this is quite simple and easy to do however it creates a unique look for your photograph so we'll repeat the procedure and do the 3D Zoom Pro for all the images. Okay, so once that is done, as you can see, we could actually play it here and we would see the effect that has been created using the 3D Zoom Pro. So you could also adjust your images so that it looks much better. You could zoom out a bit or zoom in. It depends on your preference. So once you've completed this step, you need to export We have our video clip on the timeline, so we would need to actually clip or cut this video clip, or rather split the video clip at the particular time. So each of these clips are at 3 seconds, so we need to split it approximately at 3 seconds. So once all the image has been split, you would need to click on the plus icon between each image to add transition. So the transition which we're looking for is actually dissolve, and we could simply adjust it a bit if we want once you've added the transitions you could actually ha add a little bit of speed to to let it give a little more smooth smoothness to this so you could adjust the speed you could bring up the curves and just to match how much you'd want it to go so let me adjust the speed of this one as well so for all of them i will typically be adding the same speed to the clips so for this one as well just adjust it a bit and however looks best for you you would simply leave it at that um, bring it down a bit and that's basically it this is the output so as you can see So you would simply need to mess around with it. If the dissolve um, transition does not look the best for you, you could simply adjust and use another transition in between just to allow it to, to match whatever you'd like. So that is basically how you do the 3D zoom Instagram reel. So this is all a work in progress. You could mess around with it. You could adjust what you'd like and you simply need to export or save and you're done. So... Thank you guys for watching. I hope this tutorial was helpful in getting you to do this trend or hop onto this. Um, thank you guys for watching. Hackerty Pro 7 out.